All right, we got a 30 player game here on the Australia map. I don't know if any of you know this, but uh, the factories in the game have actually just gotten a 10% uh, debuff to them. So we're gonna see how this goes. It's hopefully gonna be a little bit less crazy than the recent open front OpenFrontIO updates. Just for context, I've actually been working on a version 27 tutorial and it's so frustrating. I recorded like most of it, um, but there was a bug. So I've decided to go play a game in the meantime. Uh, I do get crown at the start, which is good. I'm thinking about how I should go about kind of annexing stuff, and I'm kind of thinking I head to the south in the Greenland. I think that's probably the best call. Poland looks pretty strong. Ideally, I want to go to the coast just with the kind of history of, uh, what is it, that uh, port access is good, but then again, who knows, because everything's changed, so I am definitely at the point where I can do a push. That's definitely too much, but it will be okay. I'm going to go for a three for annexation, basically, down here to the south. I think that's the best plan. Uh, hopefully, New South Wales does not completely screw it up. Uh, and I'm thinking about a few other things. So RYP right here. Uh, oh, no. <laughs> Speak of the freaking devil. That is, uh, that is lame as hell. We would have had a huge efficiency advantage had we gotten that. We actually do get the gold for this one thing at the very end right here. So that's not great. Um, I think this guy we're probably going to want to ally. Let's do a push over here. Um, and then we're going to see about next stages of things. I'm not really sure who I want to ally just yet. We're going to keep on doing these pushes. I think I can actually kind of tone down my push level a little bit too. To try to get this opti i'm actually cool with uh allying for right now poland i think i don't fight just because of the whole kind of challenge of uh like not great land here so let's get this annexation here let's get up one more of these i'm gonna see if i can get out to the ocean uh ryp is actually looking like a good target to me this guy looks strong i think ryp i might end up just fighting him because of how things are just looking overall. So let's keep on going with this. We're definitely kind of going down on our troop count. Opti has gone way far down on his troop count too. Uh, and we will see. I think I'm gonna chill for a little bit and then we're gonna figure things out. So this guy, I'll take an alliance with two. Uh, probably want to get up, you know, the fact that this guy has put up a factory there that makes me want to ally him. And he's actually got a lot. I'm gonna, t I'm gonna take the alliance. I'm gonna take it because I think that's a good call, and I can go for this other dude who has, uh, who's kind of getting pushed by on a few fronts. So I'm gonna, I'm gonna just push this guy. I mean, his uh, unfortunate reality of this. Oh my God, New South Wales, massive push. Uh, that's not good. I'm definitely not gonna push back on that. Um, I'm gonna wait till someone else. Actually, I am gonna push back on that in just a sec. Um because I think that's a good call. Actually, this guy, is he flipping me off? Uh, let's go for this. Let's go for this first, because uh, maybe New South Wales will actually go on another front in a bit. Uh, so the crown, is that on Opti or me? <laughs> that's, that, I think that's on Opti. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That just looks like super bugged though. Uh, so Queensland, we can go get Queensland, I think in a second. Uh, let's just go for that, because other people are pushing them. We got Bur Bur Patapim here. I don't know how I'm going to look at their kind of um reality. I think I think I probably want to ally them. I think trying to get that one city is a bad call. I don't think it's worth it. I think I should just kind of be content with what I have here. Uh, let's do one quick thing though. I'm gonna put up a defense post here because I want to just go hit uh, New South Wales really quick. Take this out. Um, I'm not completely safe just yet. Um, and I'm a little bit hesitant about, uh, what is it? Uh, a couple things. I think RY, I guess I can kind of make a factory, uh, set up with them. I think that's a decent call. They're already pretty strong. So let's just get some of these networks going. Uh, an empire right here. We're just going to go try to one-shot them and see what we can do. Um, so we're looking pretty decent. I see good guy on the other side of the map there. Uh, my kind of population growth is okay. I think that from this... I think I just go for this. I think I really just go for it. I'm also going to get up one more uh, defense post just in case BW Party does want to go for me. We will see about all this. Uh, looks like a guy in the north's taking out this. I need to be really careful about um, like alliance expiration is what I'm kind of worried about. Uh, and I don't like the idea of two fights right here. 
That's what I don't like at all. So... I think what I'm going to do, I'm going to try to ally Hercules. And then I'm going to go for BW Party. So this is pretty good. Um, it's going to suck um, when he pushes back. Which will be in just a sec. Let's put up a defense post right here. See if we can get any uh, value out of this stuff. Our factories are doing okay. Uh, let's just get up one more of these. We'll get in Borbor Patapim. Uh, this guy to the south, we got some time. I think we can just go and just kind of like roll this dude. Um, and then we can kind of have the opportunity to go for Poland. It's actually kind of crazy how little trade it looks like there is on the map. We're sitting in second place, which the thing that's going to suck about this, and I'm going to push really deep for this, is Hercules is going to get so much of this freaking infrastructure. Yeah, he is uh, He's actually in great spot. And look at Tarzan's empire over there to the left. They are AFK. That is awesome for them. Um, congratulations. I think I'm also probably... I'm going to wait and see about this. Um, but I'm going to put up a defense post right here. I don't think pushing Kenobi is a good plan. Uh, and I also feel like the risk of that is something I don't want to deal with. <laughs> that I just don't want to. So Opti, I'm definitely going to renew. Uh, I'm going to send this guy a heart. Uh, Poland is definitely just going to be one shot. Like that is that is absolutely my plan. Uh, other timers, y RYP has got a little bit of time. Uh, so we're generally good unless someone betrays this guy. I don't think... Um, don't know what we're going to do with him. I mean, Poland, I think we can pretty much just one shot, um, which will be good. So we got six seconds. We got 30 on that. Uh, so this guy, I think I'll probably take it, um, but we will see. So let's uh, let's see if we can bait out an attack from Poland. Just want to see that. Probably not. So let's just do a massive push, see what we can get, um, and hopefully clear most of them. He's actually being pushed on two fronts. The main problem is that uh, we're just pushing on the freaking defense post. We do get out to the ocean, though, so that is awesome for us. Uh, and we're going to see. I feel like with uh, this guy, with RIP, we want to renew because he's our kind of uh, factory partner. This guy, just debating this. I think we do renew it with him. I think he's too strong, um, and I don't want to piss him off that much. So let's get out a uh, little bit more of a port economy. Berber Patapim, uh, my god, that name and that stuff. We're probably going to go for him. The game already feels better, I'll just say, compared to previous versions with the type of port, uh, with the type of factory scaling I've seen. I think just the factory stuff just got so, so off the charts that I don't even know. Uh, unfortunately, RYP only, well, he's got three factories. Where are those factories at? Yeah, some of them are here. So I'm going to try to basically get that going. And I think with um, the Fur Napoleon guy, I think I'm just going to try to run through Patapim and then go for the next dude. So we will see. I don't know if there's a huge, like, betray risk. Um, the fact that he's already getting pushed by, by RYP. Uh, and we got... Uh, who did our alliance with? Gal Oli. Oh, that's just still right there. But about Patapim. Um, I'm going to send him... Uh, I'm going to send him this, even though it's not true, because <laughs> we're just going to push him. Uh, this honestly looks a little bit odd in a lot of ways. Hope that isn't a Hydra. I probably need to get up a SAM site, uh, is what I'm thinking. So let's uh, let's actually do that really quick. Let's get it up right around here. Uh, Patapim, we've got that. So I think we just go and we just try to roll the whole front and hopefully we're good. And then we'll just uh, we'll go into uh, Napoleon. So one thing I can do with getting all this, this all looks great. Um, Napoleon's actually pushing right here, so one thing I can do, I can just push him while he's down, take out his missile capacity, and that's amazing. That is just kind of quadrupling in size. I'm going to just prepare for <laughs> potential bad situation. Uh, that all looks good. That all looks great. Um, I just was putting up those defense posts just in case, just in freaking case, that uh, this guy wanted to betray me, because there could have been a timer maybe... Maybe, uh, let's go get out this. Um, I think I see where I'm going to bunker stuff if I am going to do it. I might not do it. I've kind of been thinking because I was doing the tutorial before this that like, so I think some people are tending to overinvest in Sam's. Uh, who is this Hercalius is going to expire? I don't know. 
I could totally cook him with a Hydro, is the thing. Um, let's actually just check this. He doesn't have that much. Um, he doesn't. He really, really doesn't. Let's also reset this. Um, this guy, he's got a bunch. Let's do this really quick. Let's do this. This should be good. Let's also try to ally the pig. So that totally clips him out. Unfortunately, we're getting a little bit of a loss here. Factory here doesn't have enough to mess with me. Let's try to ally Eden. Opti, we definitely want to renew. I think we just keep on renewing with other people. Um, and then we'll see. <laughs> and we'll freaking see. Kenobi up there, he doesn't have that much. So we're kind of good on this front. We're going to try to get that like level six factor. I think that would be good. Um, Kenobi, I'm just going to leave that for right now. Uh, we've got a lot into these guys. So factory here, we can uh, we can go take him out. Oh my god, he actually we cannot take him out. Uh, crap, that is actually so bad. Um, because I just burned a ton of troops. I burned a ton of troops on that. Let's renew with Kenobi. I think. Uh, let's actually accept this. Let's accept this. Yeah, yeah. Because he's got he's got a hydro. That's actually so fucking sketchy. That's like horrifyingly sketchy. Um, I thought he was like totally out of troops. So Kenobi's right there. Uh, let's put up a missile silo on the border. I just need to be using my stuff, man. Uh, Opti, oh my god. Oh my god. What am I doing, man? What am I freaking doing? I am, like, horrified at what's going on with this shit. Uh, so Kenobi right here. Uh, let's put in Hydro right here. Uh, we're basically just trying to do pop damage, uh, is the plan. Uh, that is the absolute plan. Let's go clear him, get out his stuff. RYP, I'm going to keep that as a renewal, uh, just because uh, Le Pig has a lot going on here. So we've got a bunch to think about. We got a lot. We're actually in kind of a bad circumstance in many regards. Okay, so let's uh, let's go get this out. Uh, let's go click this, clear all that. That looks good. Cool. So uh, this guy, the only thing I'm kind of worried about, I'm going to get up uh, Missile Silo right here, because uh, I think I probably should go take him out. Let's uh, actually just retake some irradiated land first, do this. I'm not doing the best with my multitasking, but we'll hopefully be okay in a sec. Um, yeah, this guy, I think I can probably just do this and win. So uh, I'm trying not to blow up his infrastructure because I kind of want to steal it all. So that clears a ton of his stuff. Uh, let's try to ally some of these other people. The fact that the UN guy is having that going on, uh, I'm also going to, uh, what am I going to do? I'm going to blow up that. I'm going to get up this right here. Uh, and uh, I'm also going to blow up this over here uh, just because I want to get rid of his ports. We got all over there. That looks good. Can we get over here? Maybe we will see. We will see indeed. <laughs> yeah, UN pig. Um, lot to be determined here. Lot, lot, lot. So I'm thinking Opti... He's got Merv now. We got to be really, really cautious about a lot of stuff going on. Because uh, Tasmania is freaking amazing. Um, but the problem is that, like... Uh, I can't remember. Is this... Oh, yeah, he's over here. He is absolutely over here. Uh, so, I don't know if we can one-shot him in time. Uh, and that's the issue. So, we get all this out. Um, Edel, we've got that. Who else has Merv? This is what I need to look at. Uh, because anyone who has, who doesn't have Merv, I can attack. Uh, Le Pig has got a ton. Uh, this guy is actually still here. I'm gonna just get rid of him, because these things can come back to bite you. Uh, if you leave them in the game. So, uh, he's gone. He's gone. Okay. So, um, I think with where I'm at, kind of debating a lot here. Uh, let's just check a few things. With Factory, it's very hard to get in, like, a good Hydra. We can probably put one right here if we want. Um, let's get up some more cities, just because we can do that. Maybe get RYP a little bit better on our side. Le Pig, uh, did he just blow his Merv? He did blow his Merv. There is counter stuff. We got a minute there. Um, so I think I'm going to get up a lot of, kind of, missile silos. This guy could be a problem, and I think... It's probably the point in time to, uh, what is it, uh, to start um, considering getting rid of him. Because I think that's kind of needed. We've only got two people on the map with Merv. So with Opti here, um, he's the one guy who can threaten me. 
Um, and I want to keep that in mind. I'm also going to try to get uh, one other boat on Edel in a second. Opti, uh, the pig, let's just look at this, because if he doesn't have the time, I'm actually going to do a couple things. I'm going to get up this right here, because this will uh, this will shoot this down. Uh, Opti, uh, Edel, we're going to renew with Edel. Uh, oh my god, he's, uh, he's trying to basically do something before he dies. Uh, so let's get that out. Uh, how much did he hit? He got all that. Okay. RYP, I'm going to clear RYP. That is for sure. Uh, who else has Merv? Factory is getting up to Merv. Uh, that makes sense. Uh, 82nd. He doesn't have much. So I think, I think we can clear him if we want. Oh my God. Who is this? 82nd and then Factory. Factory, we're going to renew. Um, 82nd. Where's his Sam sites? He doesn't have Sam sites. Okay. So we can just hit right here in just a sec. What's our timer on this other stuff? That's 30 seconds. Opti, I'm just going to renew it. Um, because fuck it. Uh, and this looks all good to me. So 82nd. Let's go there. Uh, Opti, let's renew. RYP. Unless they're super close to Merv, I'm just going to get rid of them. Um, I'm absolutely going to get rid of them. Uh, okay, so this all looks good. Edel right here. Wait, did we not renew that? We didn't renew that. That's kind of, uh... Let's actually renew with RYP. Let's renew. Because, uh, what I can do right here is, uh, I can just blow this guy up. Uh, and I should be fine. Right? Right? <laughs> so let's do this. Let's take this out. Um, and I'm hoping I can run away with the game. What I'm really kind of concerned about is, uh, okay. Uh, is this. So, uh, I'm just gonna take out that. I just win. Yeah, I just win. That's the thing. Fast enough response time. Uh, I can also just show you this. We can just launch two mers right here. Let's do a nine right on this. Uh, nine right here. Uh, cause I can still just mess up this. I know this is the after game, but fuck it. Fuck it all. Fuck it all. Um, <laughs> fuck this crap. So, um, let me know what you think. I actually think this is a good change. Um because I think it makes the games a little less bullshit, and I hopefully will see y'all in the next video in the tutorial soon.